Is this a suitable temporary repair? Should I board the edge with a two by four or would the cap nails be sufficient? Okay, this is, let's get into this. I don't know what you got going on here. If this is a job you're doing for someone to repair this or if you're the homeowner. So let's tackle this from the perspective that you are the homeowner. You've tarped this up because you were dealing with this. This is the official 2023 winner of the I think I can get another couple of years out of the roof award. I'm just teasing. I'm kidding. It's just in really bad shape. And I see you've tarped it up. Um, the horizontal batten boards that you've put down. Uh, I understand why you did that. What I would recommend you do with that is if you're going to do a horizontal board, so you've taking a two by four, whatever you used, and you ran in your nails right here. On the uphill side of that, put a just a bead of caulking across above the nail and go a couple inches either way of it to try to at least minimize some of the water flow that's gonna happen in there. And then the question is, do you need two by fours around the edge? How long are you plan on leaving this there? Because those tarps realistically in the sunshine and the weather, they're not going to last long, and they're not really going to keep 100% of the water out. They may, but odds are that within, I mean, if you get a couple months out of that, I think you're going to be doing awesome. So are you just trying to cover it until you can wait a couple weeks until a roofer gets there, or is this something you need to keep on there long term? Because if you got to keep it on there more long term, I I you're going to want to seal those things up. And then, yeah, I would put something around the edges. And I might even say, recommend that you get a roll of bisqueen and not the, the, the tarps like that. I know that it's a little more money, but you know those tarps have fibers and stuff. And after a while, they become kind of porous. And it's, it's not ideal to be your constant me um, method of keeping water out of the house. That's the, I don't know the situation there, but... Um, if that's something that just needs to get you by for a week or two or maybe a month or so at the most, then I wouldn't sweat it too much. But if it's going to be there any longer than that, I would just yeah, I'd go a little more heavy duty. Yeah, but you can get that fixed. 